Hi friends, I hope that everyone is doing well and staying home and safe. I miss you all so much and I hope you're being great listeners and kind to your parents and enjoying lots of PJ days even if we can't be there together. Um, since Passover is coming up, I wanted to teach you a song that I love to sing with everyone on Passover and also tell a little story and maybe have a special friend say hello. So I hope you all uh, are doing great and follow along with me. On Pesach we eat matzah, lots and lots of matzah. It's yummy in my tummy, lots and lots of matzah. Do, 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 do. On Pesach we eat gefilte fish, smelly elly elly gefilte fish. It's yummy in my tummy, smelly elly elly gefilte fish. And lots and lots of matzah. Do, 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 do. On Pesach we eat horseradish. <laughs> Horseradish, it's yummy in my tummy. Ha 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 ha, horseradish. And smelly elly elly gefilte of fish. And lots and lots of matzah. Do 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 do. On Pesach we eat haroset. Chop chop, haroset. It's yummy in my tummy. Chop chop, haroset. And ha 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 ha, horseradish. And smelly elly elly gefilte of fish. And lots and lots of matzah. Do, 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 do. On Pesach, we eat matzah balls. Rolly, 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 matzah balls. They're yummy in my tummy. Rolly, 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 matzah balls. And chop, chop, her roset. And ha, 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 horseradish. And smelly, elly, elly, get built of fish. And lots and lots of matzah. Do, 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 do. On Pesach, we eat chicken. Finger licking chicken, it's yummy in my tummy. Finger licking chicken, and rolly, 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 rolly matzah balls, and chop, chop, her roset, and ha, 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 horseradish, and smelly, elly, elly, gefilte of fish, and lots and lots of matzah. Do, 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 do. I hope you enjoyed that and have fun with that. There's so many fun foods and different foods that we eat on Passover and maybe you could come up with some other ones and please share it with me. Um, I can't wait to hear. Um, so I also wanted to tell the story about Passover. Um, last year PJ sent out this great book, The PJ River Ride. And so I was going to just tell a brief story about the basics of Passover. Long ago in Egypt, a mean ruler named Pharaoh makes the Jewish people slaves. They are first forced to do hard work building cities and pyramids. Pharaoh orders all baby boys born to Jewish families to be taken away. But Moses' family floats baby Moses in a basket on the river. Moses' sister Miriam watches over him when Pharaoh's daughter finds the baby and brings him to the palace to be raised. And she says, I'll protect you, my baby brother. The Jewish people don't like being slaves at all. They are hungry, tired, and have no control over their lives. They cry out to God for help. What do you want? We're slaves. You call this bread? What is that? That's matzah. <coughs> Moses, all grown up, goes out from the palace and sees an Egyptian treating a Jewish slave badly. He stops the Egyptian. Now Moses feels that he too is Jewish and runs away from Egypt. And the, the Egyptian saying, work harder. It's not very nice, is it? Moses stops them. Moses. 
Moses is herding sheep when he notices a strange bush. It's on fire, but not burning down. Amazing! He hears God's voice telling him to go to Pharaoh and demand that the Jewish people, Moses' people, be set free. And he says, who, who, me? Huh? With his brother Aaron, Moses goes to Pharaoh and says, let my people go. Pharaoh answers, never. God brings terrible plagues on the Egyptians. Water turns to blood. Frogs, wild animals, and locusts are everywhere. People and animals get sick. Hailstones fall from the sky. Everything turns dark. After each plague, Pharaoh agrees to let the Jews go free. But then he changes his mind. Finally, after the 10th plague, Pharaoh frees the Jews. Yay! Do you see all the different plagues? The time has come. With great excitement and nervousness, the Jews pack their things and rush out of Egypt. They go so fast that the bread the, the bread they are baking in celebration doesn't have time to rise. It says, hurry, we're leaving. Can I take my lamb and bread to go? So they're trying to hurry really fast before Pharaoh changes his mind again. And there he's saying, just go. The Jews think they are safe, but when they reach the big sea, they hear Pharaoh's army chasing them. Pharaoh has changed his mind again. The Jews are trapped, but then a miracle happens. The sea opens up so the Jewish people can march across between two giant walls of water. Look at that. Isn't that amazing? The sea closes up. The Jewish people are free. They sing and dance and celebrate. At Passover every year, we remember the miracle of freedom. And they're all saying, hooray, we're free, we're free. Next year in Jerusalem, we're free. Yay, happy Passover, everyone. I hope everyone enjoyed that story. And let's see. Who do I have here? Remember my sloth friend? His name is Toda. Can you say hi, Toda? Oh, Toda is so happy to see all his friends. He wishes you a happy Passover and hopes that you are all staying safe and well. Oh, he's blowing kisses. Can you say goodbye to our friends? We miss everyone so much. Goodbye, have a great week and happy Passover.